Hello everyone, I am Arpit and today I will show you how to use Cloud Simulator. So there are basically three things you must download before using Cloud Sim. First of all, you need to have an IDE. You can download uh, Eclipse IDE for Java E developers from here. And the second thing is the Cloud Sim package. You can download the Cloud Sim package from here. That is from uh, code.google.com uh, slash p slash cloud sim slash downloads slash list. Uh, then you need to have an uh, common maths file for the execution of programs so you can download it from here and I have already downloads downloaded these all three files and put it here and then extract these files I have already extracted so in Eclipse now open up the Eclipse so first ensure that uh, Java is already installed on your computer and the correct path of java is set if the correct path of java is not set then you uh, will find some errors starting eclipse so from here uh, you can uh, choose any workspace and then click ok you can set the path of java uh, here In my computer screen click on properties then advanced system settings then click on environmental variables then uh, this uh, create a new variable whose name is path and give the variable value means the path actual path to the java so i have already given the path of java here so let's add it and i have already given the path of this java c program files then java jdk then bin okay so i think the eclipse has started so now click on file the new we have to make a java project so from here click java project give any name to your project i have given csim uh, then um, browse to the location uh, where you have put your put it your uh, cloud simulator the cloud sim package so i have put it in eclipse inside yes i have got this in cloud sim you have to means browse the location where you have uh, downloaded your cloud sim or where you have moved your cloud sim so then click ok and then finish ok uh, so it will take some time to build the workspace then you, uh, you can click yes and then finish so uh, at the starting your project uh, will contain some errors because you have not imported the uh, common match file so you can include the common match file in the reference libraries right click on reference libraries uh, then click on build path then configure build path then you must include your include your uh, common match file so click on add external chars and then browse to the same location where you have uh, your common match file select all of them and then click open and then ok workspace is building it will take some time and after some time you will see that the error has gone uh, all the errors has been gone ok so uh, now we have successfully integrated our cloud sim in eclipse so you can now execute the first program cloud sim example 1 you can run it So yes, your program has been successfully executed. Uh, you can see the output here. And at last, make sure that Java is installed on your system. If you have no Java in your system, then you can uh, find this message that uh, GRE or JDK must be available in order to run Eclipse. And secondly, if you have downloaded the 32-bit version of JDK and 64-bit version of Eclipse, then you may find this error that uh, failed to load the JNI shared library so uh, in order to avoid that error you must uh, have a same configuration of Eclipse and Java and if you have any problems then you can just comment your problems here I will provide the solutions to your problem as soon as possible okay then see you soon goodbye